Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today I'm in the pepper patch and I know you're wondering where am I? I am over here. Welcome to another video. And let me get through here. So I'll give you guys an update on what's going on. This is the pepper patch. I had some bugs eating the peppers, not the leaves. And me, you know, I tried to do some research and I listened to people. So what I did, they said, spray it, dilute some vinegar and spray. All right, I went and did that yesterday and look look what the vinegar did so all this right here you can see little white spots so vinegar was a bad idea over here this is the Carolina Reaper over here we have got to pick these leaves off this is what the vinegar did you have the ghost pepper and look at this is a jungle the soil is so good these things just keep growing and growing and growing and growing down here and I can look at a, a, a tree and tell what kind of pepper it is. That's just from growing peppers. Just look at the tree. I don't have to look at the pepper. Ugh. Like, for example, this is the Trinidadian scorpion pepper. The leaves. If you can see the leaves, and back here is the Carolina Reaper. Now, if you could look at these and then you look over here, this is the Scotch Bonnet. You just look at the leaves because all of them, the leaves are shaped differently. Can't believe this. Look at the, look what the vinegar did because I thought it was a good idea to use the vinegar myself because you know you wash your stuff in vinegar and kill you know whatever but look at this guys oh god this sweet potato I gotta take it off the wall <clears throat> potatoes doing it real good I have some peppers back here hot peppers not gonna really come to nothing because simple fact is the place is so crowded and it's not getting enough sunlight oh boy I gotta watch where I step back here Woo. I'm just going through uh, nice these are Carolina Reaper Ooh, it's a jungle in here it's a jungle Trying to get through, guys. Yeah, trying to get through. Yeah. Trying to get through. Yeah. And the next thing that I see a lot of people in stores, what they make the big mistake with, with um peppers, and they trying to pass it off. Over here, you have the jalapeno tree. 
You could even look at the tell with the leaves. Right here. Move this as back. I picked some already. Alright. The big mistake that people make with um scotch bonnet and um habanero. This is a this is a habanero. Ooh, so that's that's what a habanero looks like. Okay. And that's a habanero. You see how long the bottom is? Uh, look at this. People would mistake them for scotch bonnet. They're not scotch bonnet, they're habanero. And I see Cause the pomegranate tree. If you can see the leaves. When I came home, it was dry. So I thought it was gonna die. So I watered and it's coming along. It's looking good now. Papaya tree. When I say it was hot, it was temperature was over 100 degrees. So yeah, I think come and water everybody. The avocado tree was looking bad. You see it's coming along now because it's got the water. I have plenty of June plum. Plenty, 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 plenty of June plum. Plenty of June plum coming along. I gotta take off all the ones that's dried up. I gotta prune them. As you can see, see everything was looking yellow, lack of water. Guava tree looking good, guava they hanging in there, they hanging in there. And I found out a little trick. You see how big the pineapple tree is? I found out a little trick to make your pineapple blossom quicker. And the trick is get bananas, ripe bananas. Put water inside a jar and put the ripe bananas. Don't peel the bananas. Put them in, in the jar, put some water in it and let it sit for 24 hours. Make sure the jar is locked tight and let it sit for 24 hours. And that same water, you just pour it directly in the middle of the pineapple pour it directly in the middle of it and you could do it two to three times uh, a week and just let it sit 
and within <clears throat> a month and a half you start seeing the pineapple start to shoot <coughs> so that's the tip for the day hey thanks for watching catch you guys on the next one